The night was dark and silent as a shadowy figure, clad in black, moved swiftly through the halls of the prestigious Montclair Museum. The security system had been expertly bypassed, leaving no trace of the intruder's presence. Their objective was simple but audacious, to steal the museum's most valuable art collection. Among the stolen pieces was the Serenade, a renowned painting by the reclusive artist Victor Marchand. Its vibrant colors and intricate details made it an artistic masterpiece worth millions. Detective Emma Reynolds was assigned to the case. With her sharp mind and keen eye for detail, she arrived at the museum the next morning to assess the situation. The museum staff, in a state of shock and disbelief, recounted the events of the night before. Emma Emma examined the security footage but found nothing conclusive, only glimpses of the figure skillfully maneuvering through the dimly lit corridors. As Emma delved deeper into the investigation, she discovered that the security system had been meticulously hacked. The level of expertise displayed indicated an inside job, making it all the more challenging to identify the culprit. Emma interviewed the museum employees, searching for any leads or suspicious behavior. She discovered that the museum's head of security, Jason Miller, had recently fallen into financial distress. Could desperation have driven him to orchestrate the heist? While Emma focused on Jason, she couldn't ignore the possibility of an external party with a vested interest in acquiring the art collection. The stolen artwork could fetch a fortune on the black market, attracting the attention of wealthy collectors and criminal organizations alike. As the investigation progressed, Emma received an anonymous tip leading her to an abandoned warehouse on the outskirts of town. Acting on her instincts, she ventured into the dimly lit building, her heart pounding with anticipation. Inside, she discovered a hidden chamber filled with stolen artwork, the serenade included. The figure stepped forward, revealing their identity to be Victor Marchand himself, the artist behind the serenade. It was a shock to Emma, who had believed him to be reclusive and uninvolved. Victor confessed that he had orchestrated the heist as an elaborate plan to expose the corruption within the art world. He revealed that Jason, the head of security, had indeed been involved, but only as a pawn in a much larger scheme. The stolen artwork was intended to be a symbol of resistance against the wealthy elite who controlled the art market. Emma's world was turned upside down as she unraveled the intricate layers of deception and manipulation. She had to confront the moral dilemmas surrounding art, greed, and justice. Should she bring Victor to justice for his crimes, or should she sympathize with his cause? The vanishing heist had become much more than a simple crime. It had evolved into a battle of ideals, forcing Emma to question her own beliefs and the blurred lines between right and wrong. The mystery had taken an unexpected turn, leaving her with a difficult choice to uphold the law or challenge it in the name of justice.